You have eye bookies. You have eye bookies with glitter on them. Go. Say goodnight, Nico. No bite, no bite, no bite. Good boy. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Good morning, guys. It is currently 6:45, and. Pretty sure one of my ears are clogged. I probably sound like a mess. I probably look like a mess. My nose is stuffy and itchy. I keep sneezing. I actually woke up because I just had to blow my nose and then I just kept sneezing and sneezing. Um, I mean, stuff's definitely coming out, but I literally only have one dose of Mucinex left from the last package of Mucinex that I bought. So I'm up early anyway, cause I can't go back to sleep. I just, I just feel uncomfortable. So I'm about to hop in the shower and slowly start getting ready to head to CVS or Walgreens. Um, I think CVS cause I got a coupon. And that's my shower running in the back because I guess the house is old and the pipes need time to warm up and right now my hot water is spitting out cold water. So I'm going to start getting ready, I'm going to take Miko out. I just want to get better. I'm off today so today is the day to flush this thing out or to at least get it under control, get the symptoms under control before it turns into an infection. I need to drink more water even though I don't feel like I don't want to do anything. I just want to stay in bed all day. Okay, so it is 8.15 and I have finally made it to CVS. They opened 15 minutes ago. I was busy, not so much warming up my car, although my car was nice and toasty by the time I actually was able to get in it. But it was more of just... um getting some stuff that I was returning. I'm returning the um, dog shoes. Let me get my $30 back. Thanks, Amazon. I also have to drop off. I have it in the back here. It's um, my Thread Up package. Um, I am donating some clothes. Well, I'm basically giving them the clothes to sort, and if I get a few bucks out of it, hey, better. If not, then somebody can... Um, definitely use the clothes that no longer fit me and then I'm really tempted to stop by the house and pick up Miko and take him to the dog park but I think it's too cold for him and I don't have a doggy sweater I do have my tea with me that was very hot all right guys let's go all right yes I decided to let my hair down one, it's cold and it's going to be like my scarf. <laughs> and two, just because I feel like shit doesn't mean I should look like shit. So this is what I'm getting. Uh, it's the Mucinex Severe Cold Fast Max. The liquid gel so that it dissolves faster. I wish I had water with me and my tea's not cold enough to drink with that. So that's going to have to wait for a little bit. And I also found this lavender scented... Vapo Vix rub. I am like super excited. I love Vix. Ponte Vix. Ponte Vix. Ponte Vix. I grew up with Vix, um, as most Spanish Hispanic uh, children have. My mom too. She hates Vix just because of how much she uh, had to use it growing up. But I love, love, love Vix. It is really relaxed. Oh my God, yes. Oh yeah. I'm just putting a little on there so I could smell it and then when I get home I'm gonna like put a shitload on my chest and I feel like it's not as um 
like potent not that is not as potent it's not as overwhelming as the original Vicks scent for those who really don't like Vicks that much um, it's just for me it's just so soothing but I I love Vicks so this is like awesome I'm so glad I got it even though I can't taste right now I really want a grilled cheese bacon sandwich and for some reason CVS didn't have cheese or bacon and I know I shouldn't have the cheese but I have to go drop off a package at FedEx Target is right there Target has all my dietary needs it seems um, it's like a good little whole food substitute so I'm gonna head over to Target um, after I drop the package off and get some cheese and bread because I really want a grilled cheese um, and maybe a soup let's go all right guys just got to Target I already dropped off my FedEx um, and somebody's car alarm is going off Anyway, on the hunt for my grilled cheese sandwich ingredients. So as soon as I enter Target, I automatically gravitate to the clothes. I don't know why, it's a problem that I have. And clearly it is not summertime, but the swimwear is already out and I'm actually really excited to get something new this year since I lost some weight and I just basically <laughs> window shopped around and tried to escape the section as fast as I could. I have to remember to tilt the camera this way and not the other way. But yeah, they already have like summer stuff. How crazy is that? It's not even Christmas. And it's so freaking cold outside not to mention, but oh my god, clothes. I need to like get out of this section because I didn't come here for that. I came here for food. Food. Okay. I'm currently in the Christmas section because I figured, let me see if they have like a nice tree topper on sale. Mm. That is so cute. I kind of want that. I don't know what tree topper to get. Not really feeling the stars all that much. And no rose gold. So sad. So no tree toppers, but I finally made it to the food section. Oh my god, they have my pasta. Totally awesome, low carb life. Okay, I am back home. We are back home. And my good boy is actually eating, but I've been encouraging him to eat, so that's probably the only reason why he's eating more than I've seen him eat in one sitting. And I already took my Mucinex, and I'm probably gonna have to get more on Thursday if I'm not feeling better because I realized 16 capsules will only last me for two days because it's two capsules every four hours. So we shall see how I feel by then. But usually you should take Mucinex for about a week um, just to kind of clear it all up and then if it doesn't clear up, see a doctor. But I am not a doctor, just a nurse that has learned from experience being a patient herself. Since earlier this year I was sick with the same thing and all they gave me was to take some Mucinex, something for my cough, and a prescription for antibiotics um, if I became more symptomatic because it kind of looked like the beginning of an ear infection. Anyway, I am going to... Tea is still hot. It's actually getting better. I'm going to start making my breakfast because I am super, super hungry. Um... And I mentioned earlier, I want a grilled cheese with bacon. So I have my butter, I have my sourdough bread, I have my cheese, and I don't really remember how this tastes. I know I've had it before, but it feels really soft and it looks really creamy, so I'm kind of excited. And then, of course, my bacon. I'll probably season my bread with a little bit of garlic powder. I don't want to overwhelm and take away from the sourdough. Um, I'm not a chef guys like I just like cook with the ingredients that I love pretty much binging on and then I have some uh, coffee well I haven't made it yet but yes I'm gonna have coffee and I'm actually thinking of frothing my creamer we shall do that stick around
Here is my grilled cheese on sourdough bread with Havarti cheese and some bacon. And I have my coffee and that's my cat. So I am going to enjoy this delicious breakfast before it gets cold. And my Christmas onesie. And the video quality is different because my camera is currently busy uploading all the other crap I vlogged earlier today and stuff. And I don't know why it's taking extra long so I had to redo it again. And I don't feel like sitting in the chair. I want to be in bed. I'm in bed. I got my laptop. I have my oil diffuser slash humidifier. I have my tea, have tissue. And I already put on the Vicks. And I have my cuddle buddy. She's the best. So, gonna Netflix it up or probably just binge on YouTube that vlog on this video. That's what I've been doing. It's so kind of awesome. All right, good afternoon, almost good evening. Time is not a thing. Anyway, I'm in trapped here with Miko because the cats are out and Miko and Max don't know how to play nice still, so what are you eating? I hope it's food. Puppies, kittens, young animals. They're all so stupid. <laughs> well, just still learning. And my camera died. Anyway, I am now in the kitchen because I am hungry. I need to eat something. It's already 5 o'clock, I think. And I decided to try out these veggie tots that I bought um, from Walmart a little while ago. And there they are. I'm going to bake them. Set at 450 to bake for approximately, I think it was 15 to 18 minutes. So, And then I'm going to heat up my chicken noodle soup and finish that and I'm having it with a side of tater tots. I'm just waiting for this oven to be done preheating so I could pop these in there and stuff my face. And I'm still in the onesie. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe I could have gotten away with a size small, but uh, it's fine. I already washed it and dried it, so that's probably why. And my arms are rolled up. That's not like stretched out all the way. So I think a medium is fine in terms of like length, but there definitely is like a lot of room. And this one is for women in case people were wondering, well, why you have so much room down there? Maybe you got one for a guy. I did it. <clears throat> I got one for women and it was still like that. That's what they look like. My beautiful tots. Okay, so this is my dinner, early dinner. These are the broccoli and cheese tater tots with some mustard because I don't have um, ketchup because ketchup has too much salt in it. Some water and my soup. And hopefully all of this satisfies me. I highly doubt it. And I'm pretty sure none of this goes together anyway, but it's what I'm gonna eat because it was quick and easy. So yeah.